Hey guys, as I am trying to wrap up my work day and get dinner heated up, and after I already did a video where I was sharing about my cardigan collection and how it can help you to look slimmer, and it made me think about some of the anti-aging hacks that I might have um, shortchanged you guys with in a previous video where I was talking about my sundress collection as it relates to anti-aging hacks of how I look younger than um, my 58 years. I hope I'm looking younger. People tell me, hopefully they're not pulling my leg, but I just wanted to share just some cut and dry ones. A lot of times I'm majoring in what I say at work in verbosity where I give a lot of information um, where I could just like sum it up a lot quicker. So right now I'm going to sum it up um, quicker. Um, there are about seven things that I can say that I can immediately point to and say these are things that you want to do if you are trying to look younger. And the first one would be water. Water needs to become your best friend more so than soda, um, more so than any bottled teas or things that, you know, have sugar added to them. Water is what you need for your friend. Um, it needs to be your friend for your skin. I mean, so um, water, sunscreen. Um, I use an SPF 30 every day and I have been um, for well over a decade. I started using sunscreen initially, probably SPF 15, when my boys were babies. Um, my oldest son is going to be 30 in November. My youngest is going to be 28. So sunscreen has been my friend. Um, if you're curious about the type that I use, um, check out my video on skincare. If I remember, I'll put that as an end screen so you can see what my um, morning regimen is. Um, exercise. I'm a big advocate of exercise, whether you can run or not, whether it's low impact or high impact, you just got to do something, you got to get your butt moving. So five mornings a week, over two hours a day. Um, before I'm sitting here at this table at 8.30. Um, on the weekends, I walk at least 45 minutes on the treadmill, and then I try to walk in the neighborhood with my husband. Um, we're too sedentary. That um, keeps your body from producing the growth hormone, which I believe helps people to look younger too. So um, definitely exercise and then intermittent fasting, I think has really helped me. Um, I only eat between 12 and eight for the most part. On the weekends, you know, I might um, relax that just a little bit in the evenings, but for the most part, 12 to eight, I'm not eating after eight o'clock. Um, and then not drinking alcohol. If you drink and you, you know, drinking is a staple and it's something you can't see yourself living without, um, then just reduce the amount of alcohol that you're drinking. Water should be your primary drink. And then mm, the final thing, so water, sunscreen, exercise, intermittent fasting, not drinking. Um, let's see, is there anything else I can think of before I say turning over things that are too hard for me to God? Um, I love to just say in the name of Jesus all over it. When people are telling me about problems I can't control or things I can't change, I just have to let that stuff go. It's not keeping me up at night. Um, you know, I'm sleeping. Um, I'm going on with my life and, you know, I'll just figure it out as I go along. And I turn it over to someone who can do something about it. Don't run around worrying. Um, it'll show up on your face. And then I did have another one, a sixth one. Um, fast food is not your friend. Um, you need to limit that as much as possible and try to get to a point. And yes, your girl is 58. She's sweating because she has on a cardigan and these bright lights. And the oven is on, so I apologize. But anyway, um, no fast food as often as possible. Um, don't eat breakfast at McDonald's. Um, find you some yogurt, some cereal, or whatever. And I know people say, oh, the cereals have added sugar. But it's funny how people never point out the bad things about like potato chips, candy bars, um, alcohol. You don't hear anyone lecturing you about, well, you know, alcohol can contribute to cancer. You don't get lectures on that. You get lectures on things that you um, are eating that are pretty decent, that might have whole grain in them so you know find out you know some fruit some granola some oatmeal something healthy stop going to Mickey D's for breakfast I know they're advertising and making it sound exciting but fast food is not your friend and um, if there's oh and smoking um, don't smoke anything don't smoke cigarettes don't smoke marijuana um, it's not your friend 
um, leave that alone. So those are seven things that I can think of that are reasons why I'm looking younger than what um, people expect me to look like. So hopefully that helps somebody. And this will be one of the shortest videos I've ever done. So let me know if you have any questions and I'm going to get back to work and get back to making dinner for my husband. But anyway, guys, hopefully this helps someone out there. If you have any questions, let me know. Until the next time, have a good one.